NVIDIA sold most of the GeForce RTX 3080 3090 video cards for $175 million to miners. GeForce RTX 3000 series graphics cards began to appear on the market. There is no talk about stabilizing prices and overcoming the deficit, which means that for a fast game model you will have to pay much more money than we would like to. For a long time, experts pondered what could have led to this situation. Moreover, several plausible theories have already been put forward. For example, we were told about the problem of low-quality capacitors that do not draw powerful cards. It was also reported about Samsung's inability to cope with the order that fell on the company, which led to a shortage of graphics chips. In addition, some analysts suggested that the miner's variable should not be excluded from the equation. Well, apparently, it is these guys who are guilty of the disappearance of the GeForce RTX 3000 series from the stores, or rather, the fact that the card simply did not get there. This data was provided by financial analysts from RBC Capital Markets and Barons. Allegedly, Nvidia gave the miners new flagships RTX 3080 3090 worth at least $175 million. It is reported that Nvidia did a reported an unprecedented 37% increase in profits in the gaming direction compared to last year. Throwing out the experts' reasoning on this topic, we summarized that most of the released video cards were sold to miners. It is also indicated that a similar situation will continue in the fourth quarter.